little peaches. How you doing, girl? You're so pretty. Yes, you are. Her incision looks like it's healing really well. Nobody can see you if you're hiding behind me. I posted some pictures of her that I took yesterday on the critter room. Including a close up of the incision site. I saw that somebody liked being brushed. Are we ready to trim some claws, huh? Protect these white legs of mine? Yeah. You know, it's getting warmer. And after the claw trimming, if I survive, I have an announcement to make concerning peaches and kugra. I'm a trim. He keeps nagging. Let me move closer to the cam so you guys can watch the bleeding take place. I prefer to use regular nail clippers. Clippers? Trimmers? Clippers? <laughs> and if you do use regular fingernail clippers, they're claws like this. You want to Cut in so that from the sides of the claw. If you go top to bottom, it could cause it to split. Who's a happy girl? Ooh, that one's really sharp. I was thinking, that one's not bad. That one's not bad. Whoa, that one's bad. Quick break. Okay, let me try trimming them while you're sitting down. Just one more. All done. All done.
one thing that's interesting was seeing her eye socket area shaped is how the skull is shaped around their eyes. And she lost all her whiskers on her left side. They'll grow back though. Where's that brush? Peaches is one of the few cats that I can actually bury my face into and not get a all weepy eyed and allergic. Oh, about Cougar and Peaches. Cougar is still not eating on his own, but he's holding steady. I think he's suffering from depression, and I've been working to try to coax him out of that. But I'm going to give him a bath later, so he's nice and clean. He hasn't been grooming himself lately. So his coat's getting oily. Other cats are trying to help, but still not enough. And then once he's all dry and handsome looking, I'll bring him in for a date with peaches. And no, I will not be adopting Peaches. She's got at least one person who is definitely looking forward to her becoming available for adoption. And it sounds like the perfect home for her. But not everything is set in stone. So if you're interested, if you're interested in adopting Peaches, you can send in a pre-adoption questionnaire and see what happens. And Peaches will be with us for at least another week. Sounds like Trillian wants out of my bedroom.
call out to Chris. Chris! Still not a good idea to stick my face in a fur because then the fur sticks to my face. And she's gotten back all her belly fur from when they checked to see if she was spayed. Her tail is starting to swish fast, or faster, which tells me I need to just let her do the work. If she gets overstimulated, she'll snip at me. Not hard or anything. Okay, Peaches, I'm going to step out now and check on Coop. It's time for his dinner. You be a good girl, okay? Try not to growl so much at him during your date. Enjoy your peaches. Have a nice day. Oh, forgot my glasses. I'm 13, I need to stay out of the tunnel. <laughs>